after due consideration and after a meeting, I would like to ask if any of the members have any comment that they would like to make. Mr. Rayner? Uh, yes, sir, thank you. Uh, this has been uh, quite experience in that, uh, as, as I have heard in paper, I've talked to people of the Code of Ethics, how important it is, but yet it uh, needs uh, more than some fine tuning, and, and I think this is a, an example of, of uh, we are working with what we have, uh, but uh, it, it could be better. I appreciate uh, Councilwoman Archer to come and talk to us about this and give us her opinion so that we could see um, what she was thinking and, and how she, uh, and her advice for council, uh, the decisions that she was making and uh, uh, how that reflects back to <coughs> the of ethics that we have right now. And so that, um, that made an, an impression and, and helped me with uh, my decision on uh, how I'll vote uh, tonight, sir. Ms. McDaniel. Thank you. So I am acutely aware of the degree of interest our community has in this ethics ordinance. And I think it's only fitting for the people who wrote the ordinance to go back and address it and do the work that needs to be done to make an ordinance that we would be proud of. <coughs> I, I look at Councilwoman Armature and I have a tremendous amount of respect for her. Um, I think about the community that's watching what's going to happen with this uh, decision and I also think about her constituents, the people who voted for her her base, the, uh, the voters out there, all of the citizens who look to her to, to represent them on city council. So it's a very high standard that, that we put on city council, for better or for worse. But it's, it's, also, um, it's also a standard that uh, I, I appreciate that from what I heard from you and from your attorney that you were really <coughs> thinking about um, the, what is in the best interest for your constituents. And so I really appreciate that as, my, as well. Um, and that did help me come to, to a decision. Mr. Mohair. I too agree that uh, to see in the ordinance as it is written that it undoubtedly needs uh, some work uh, in, in areas that has caused this situation to arise. Uh, for one, um, and knowing what the way things are written and what's presented, um, it, it, it gave some definite, in, in my opinion, and my, in my beliefs of what's what's before us. I, I do uh, do agree with Ms. Daniels that you know we do put a level of uh, high level on, on our city councilmen to do, do the right thing for the constituents for the city and I'm not, I believe that, that that is being done. Don't be wrong. You and others, I believe that all y'all have been done but uh, with that um, this ethics committee uh, a task they've been assigned to um, had you know, decisions made on what's before us, not what we think or what we would like it to be, it's really based on what's before us. And that uh, to help me make my decision going forward. Is it the consensus of the committee to do the vote tonight? <clears throat> Under Ethics Complaint 19002, the 
Board of Ethics concerning the allegations of violations of ethics ordinance, ordinance section 2, 272, and 273. The vote needs to be a record vote. It needs to be spoken up, and I'll call each member's name and have them to vote. Yes or no on the violation. I think you need a motion. Motion. And a second question. Is there a motion? I make a motion that the ethics committee make the vote tonight. And is there a second? I second the motion. Mr. Rayner, your vote, please. I vote uh, in favor of the violation. Ms. McDaniels? In favor of violation. Mr. Moher? In favor of the violation. And the chair votes in favor. Based on that, finding that there is a violation of the ethics, is there a motion or a recommendation for sanction? Ms. McDaniels? Mr. Mohair. I make I make a recommendation that we do no sanctions uh, in accordance to this violation. And I second the motion. Hearing a motion and the second. <coughs> is everyone in favor? All everyone in favor say aye. 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 Based on that, that concludes our meeting for tonight. It is 9 o'clock. Thank you very much. Thank you all for your time. Thank you very much.